Nestled away in the south of Sydney, only 25 minutes from Sydney's bustling CBD, lies San Suzy Baths, a tucked away spot sheltered by the Captain Cook Bridge overlooking beautiful Botany Bay. Having grown up nearby, I believed I knew all there was to know about San Suzy, but it was only just the other day that I stumbled upon the rich history that accompanies the suburbs, long stretching beaches, many sailing clubs, and of course, the baths that date back to 1897. So please join me, Francis Tatsoulis, as I share with you my secret Sydney. Although the Captain Cook Bridge is frequently used by people connecting St George to the Sutherland Shire, or as the locals say, separating us from them, many people aren't aware that you can actually walk under the bridge. The unknown passageway leads you down a picturesque walkway and just before San Susie's famous motorboat club is where you'll find the baths. Whilst it's clear to see that the door is locked, it's hard to understand when looking out at the water why the once populated place over a hundred years ago is now abandoned. During its peak, the baths were a place where people could enjoy a nice swim in an attempt to beat the heat. In the late 1800s, a steam tram was built between Cogra and San Susie, a common commute for those who either swam competitively or simply wanted to enjoy the area. The phrase San Susie itself is derived from the French expression, no worries. And if you close your eyes and listen to the waves crashing on the shore, you were taken back 119 years ago to a time when the quiet suburb was a buzzing tourist attraction, enjoyed by people without a care. Open them and all you can see are rusted remnants which go unnoticed. With several parks and cafes nearby, it's obvious why this scenic spot is ideal for a family picnic or gathering, as it certainly lives up to San Susie's reputation of no worries. As more and more homes get built in San Susie, the baths may not remain a secret for much longer, but until then it will continue to be off the grid and enjoyed by me, the few locals that know about it, and perhaps even yourselves. I'm Francis Tatsoulis signing off for My Secret Sydney.